In this lesson, we'll go through several examples discussing whether an anion is basic or pH neutral. The question reads, classify each anion as a weak base or pH neutral. So we have one of two options, whether it's a weak base or pH neutral, meaning that it is neither acidic nor basic. Keep in mind two things before we start, that if the anion is coming from a strong acid, that means a strong acid completely dissociated. And if a strong acid completely dissociates into its anion, that anion is pH neutral. However, if the anion is coming from a weak acid, when that weak acid dissociates, it dissociates incompletely, forming the anion as a conjugate base. And as a result, the conjugate base is referred to as the weak base. So starting with A, we have NO3 minus. Take a look at these two charts. We have one chart for strong acids and one chart showing all the weak acids. The anion here, NO3 minus, is not found in this chart, which suggests that it is coming from a strong acid. In fact, if you look right here, NO3 minus is a derivative of HNO3. Because HNO3 is a strong acid, it dissociates completely, forming an anion that is pH neutral. So the example here is pH neutral. In question B, we have NO2 minus. There is no derivative of NO2 minus in this first table, but you could find one here. Take a look. Nitrous acid has the chemical formula HNO2, and it is a weak acid. It will dissociate incompletely, forming a conjugate base. So this is a conjugate base, therefore a weak base. Let's do the same sort of analysis for C. We have C2H3O2 minus, and I notice that in this table, here we have acetic acid, and its chemical formula is HC2H3O2. Notice that if it loses a proton, it becomes the anion that you see here. Since it's a weak acid, then this anion is a conjugate base, therefore we call it a weak base. The next example, D, CHO2 minus. Let's see if we can spot that in this table. I can't, so it must be a weak acid, but let's double check. I found it right here. It's formic acid. Formic acid is a weak acid, and its chemical formula is HCHO2. It has a similar chemical formula to CHO2 minus, and since it's a weak acid, this one should be a weak base as well. And finally, ClO4 minus. The derivative of this anion is perchloric acid, having the formula HClO4. Because it's coming from a strong acid, this molecule completely dissociates, forming a pH neutral derivative as ClO4 minus. So this is pH neutral. And there you have it. That is how to determine whether an anion is basic or pH neutral.